So I haven't had the time to figure out exactly why this camera has so much noise in it when I use it. If you don't know what noise is, that, well, yes, it is sound, obviously, but when talking about a video picture, it means, like, all the... If, if you look all around, there's lots of, like, this all around. That's noise. That's what that is. And I have yet to figure out exactly why it does it. I don't think this camera should do that because it's a relatively fancy camera although maybe the most fancy thing about it is that it has the built-in ring light I don't know but I gotta play around with it unfortunately I currently don't have the time to do that in fact I had no time to make this video which is why we're doing what we're doing which apparently is rambling but that's not the point of this video go ahead and roll the thing Hey guys, Sean here. So as I was saying, I don't have a lot of time to make a video right now, and that's because my work is starting to really kick into the extreme overtime. In fact, I have to work both days this weekend. I've been working since Monday, obviously, and I don't know when my next day off is, and I've started working until 7 o'clock at night, and that will just become more and more as the days goes on. So I was gonna do my normal numbered video this week and then I was also going to do an unboxing video this week, but I don't have time to do both. So this numbered video is going to be an unboxing video, especially because I've waited long enough that it doesn't matter anymore if I do the unboxing when I do it. So I guess with that, let's go ahead and roll the unboxing thing. What's in the box? So if you are a longtime viewer of this channel, both of you, then you know that I have been getting Funko collector boxes in the mail that come bi-monthly. I was getting Star Wars ones and Marvel ones. And the Marvel ones, they stopped because they decided that they were gonna go a new route with them, and that is that they now go through Amazon. You just buy them through Amazon. You don't subscribe to it anymore. And when they announced that, they were basically like, okay, so if you still have a subscription, we're just gonna give you the rest of the money that you would have paid for the remainder of the subscription, and then that's it. You won't get any more boxes. So that happened like three or four months ago, and I was like, well, when are they gonna do that with the Star Wars one? Because I kept getting the Star Wars ones. Well, it turns out, uh, like this week is when that was gonna happen. Okay, maybe more like three weeks ago But I got an email saying we're gonna discontinue the Star Wars collector's box We're gonna try and figure out a new partner for that and then you can get it through that and I was like hooray Because I was planning on canceling it anyway eventually even though I would never actually get around to canceling it So the other day I got this this is the last Star Wars smugglers bounty box I will be receiving as you can see here. There is Anakin Skywalker on the top of it I believe the theme for this is revenge of the Sith. So let's go ahead and open this up I should switch over to the dual cam There oh something happened on my computer. That is not relevant to this video. Anyway, we will open it up of course, the main thing here is this big box, but we're gonna go see what else is in here. So, first thing in here is a clone trooper luggage tag, because that's something that's needed and whatever. That's a weird combination. Let's cut to it being opened. Okay, so here you can see it's the luggage tag. We'll show it up here because this camera is better for this sort of stuff, even though. They are, in fact, the same camera. So this is Commander Cody, and he is in the process of receiving Order 66, which is the order to kill all the Jedi. And that is uh, Darth Sidious there, AKA Emperor Palpatine. And yeah, this is a luggage tag. What a weird, weird product to come up with. So we'll put him there. Next up is the patch, which is not showing up well on that camera. So we will do it on this one here. It is Anakin Skywalker and Darth Vader. Of course, the same person. And it says Revenge of the Sith. 
And in the Star Wars writing, as always, it says Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty. Next up, there is a mystery mini, but like most mystery minis in these types of boxes, it has only one character on the box, so it is in fact not a mystery. I don't know why they still call it a mystery mini when there's only one potential character in the box. It does, however, say Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty exclusive on it. And yes, it is, okay, we'll do it with the overhead again. It is, can we, can we get the light to, trying to get the light to, how about over here? Can we get, can you focus on him over here, maybe? He's just so Caucasian. So it's Grand Chancellor Palpatine showing off the fact that he is, in fact, a Sith Lord with his lightning powers, which of course happens in Revenge of the Sith. And then we have the pin here. Here's the pin. Here you can see it up here. It says Star Wars, and then, of course, as always, it says Smuggler's Bounty in the Star Wars writing across the bottom, and it is Mace Windu, trying to figure out which direction to go here. It's Mace Windu. There we go. Mace Windu. This is the first box in a very long time where I got both a patch and a pin. And then lastly, there is this Funko Pop set here as you can see there is obi-wan kenobi and anakin skywalker who has gone full darth vader before getting the remainder of his limbs cut off by obi-wan as they duel on mustafar and we'll show it on this camera as well because seems to do a little better with the lighting as always it is a Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty exclusive and there you can see a picture of it so it was really cool the way that they did his eyes because he had turned full Sith by this point so his eyes are super creepy looking so there you have it the movie moments duel of Mustafar Smuggler's Bounty exclusive with Anakin Skywalker and Obi-Wan Kenobi the not mystery, mystery mini, super Caucasian, Grand Chancellor Palpatine as he is revealing the fact that he is Darth Sidious. There is the Mace Windu pin, the Anakin Skywalker slash Darth Vader patch, and the Commander Cody Order 66 luggage tag. And then there is a box of trash. So that's going to do it for any sort of Funko Collector's Box reviews on this channel because this is the last one that I'm going to get. Now I think part of the reason why they waited for this box to come out before canceling the Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty uh, line or whatever you want to call it, the subscriptions, is because this was the last one if you had subscribed at the beginning. So. This was technically the last one for me before I would need to renew my subscription. So I think that's why they waited until this one. There is a chance that I will get one more boss trophy, which if you go back in my channel, I'll link to the last one up here, which it's a little trophy that you got for being a annual subscriber. So there is a strong likelihood I will get one more of those. But as for the series, overall the Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty unboxing videos and just Funko unboxing videos in general this is the end and I'm kind of glad it is because I have run out of room for Funko Pops so let me know in the comments down below if you were subscribed to Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty and if you will continue getting them now that they are no longer subscriptions and you have to buy them individually and what you liked in this box if you got it uh, I'm going to say the, that this is the best part of it because this is pretty amazing overall still don't understand the commander Cody getting order 66 luggage tag that is such a random item that wow and while you're down in the comments if you like this video go ahead and hit the like button and if you'd like to see more of the crazy crap that goes on around here no longer including any sort of Smuggler's Bounty or Collector's Core unboxings, unfortunately, but there will be other things down the line. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button, 
And if you'd like to help support the crazy crap that goes on around here, go ahead and hit up my Patreon. And with that, have a good however long it is until you watch my next video.